Hi, YouTube. How are you doing? And welcome back to Phasmophobia. Today, we are going to do a, a little trick to try and get as many levels as possible as fast as possible. I heard or I got this one from a tip of you guys in the, the comment section down below, which is playing on Sunny Meadows Restricted rather than any of the other small maps. Why is Sunny Meadows Restricted? Well, they actually changed the size of this map recently, which is something I completely forgot about. This map is now considered the same size as Prison. It is a medium map, which means you get mega high rewards here. So if you put on a high difficulty, go to Sunny Meadows restricted you can get really quick games with mega high rewards which is exactly what we're going to be doing today it's going to be fun i hope you enjoy if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you dislike it dislike it but let's not waste any more time now let's hop into the game let's go what do we get time to drop all my life savings uh hopefully on doubt will it be a moroi we'll see how that goes two million that's pretty high two million and 20 million doubters what the hell okay People are excited for some ghost gambling. Those are some high numbers. Okay, so what is the challenge right now? It is zero evidence, zero sanity, no grace period, which gives you around a 10 times multiplier, which is ins insanely high. Now that's also a very risky challenge. However, we have almost entirely tier three items, so we should be good, hopefully. Uh, and it's so it's basically gonna be like a no evidence challenge on a relatively large map, but much better than something like uh, Prison or High School, which High School is considered a large map. Prison, I really don't understand why Prison is considered a media map. Pr so what is the difference, by the way? Because this is a big, important uh, uh, thing that you might not even know. Uh, why is there two Sunny Meadow maps? One is the regular Sunny Meadows. One of them is this, which is a randomly, well, not randomly generated, but the exact layout is randomly generated. It will basically have blocked off portions such as this. I cannot go here. The ghost cannot be there. I cannot go there. The ghost cannot be there. I can only go down. And then I think there's like five different versions of this map or something like that. And then down here, there will be either the left or the right side. So this is blocked off. You see this? So I can't go right. I can only go left. So what what does the map look like at the moment? I can... Oh, no, that's already turned on. Spooky sound. Uh, it is only the entrance, the chapel, and then the left side. Now, next time we'll return here, it'll be another version. We'll maybe get the right side down here or the right or left upstairs or the middle. Um, which is also really neat because you get a different version of this map every time. So you get like a, you get a lot of variety out of a one single map. Uh, oh, really? Just slam that in my face. Is it going to be fast? Is this a miling or is it just not here? It might just not be there. Unless it's like stuck at the back. Let's see if it's over here. Is that slow? Definitely not a more say for a Dio. Don't kill me. Ah, Grandma! Grandma? Grandma, we can talk about it. Grandma, we can talk about it! Oh no, Grandma. Normal blinking. Oh god. <laughs> when did I smudge for the first time? Okay. That is freaking scary. I think I smudged like 20 seconds ago or something. Was that a poltergeist? I don't think so. I have no smudge right now, which is very scary. It came it came from right next to us. Yeah, this one maybe? Of course, many door touches. Now we're not gonna get it. Oh man, that looks fucking cursed. <laughs> That's so good. This entire place is messed up. Uh, can you give us a sign? I would love to get a ghost vent if possible. So we got the repel, we got the cleanse. You really want to do the objectives. Now you can also actually find the bone usually um, because the map is relatively small. I am going to quickly check over here if the bone is in the morgue. I don't think we have hiding spots. Oh, it's stinky in here. Big stinky. Hello there, Lisa. How you doing? No! Oh! Lisa, you need to take a shower. Okay, that was so fast. Was that a demon? That basically has to be demon, right? 
That was extremely fast. Unless we have to, like, we have to time it properly. I don't know how long it was. Like, after I, when I released much, because I was too busy fucking staying alive. That seems very suspicious, though. Mimic. Yeah, this is not a Moroi, which is what chat was looking for, by the way. But it could always be a Mimic. It's always either the ghost or a Mimic. Okay, it's still hunting. Okay, there we go. I mean, I feel like that is almost certainly uh, a demon. Unless it hunted, like, right at 1.30. And we had... Um, and we smudged it, like, way earlier than we thought. But I'll ding it. I'll ding it for good luck. That means it's gonna be a demon. It was such an early hunt, right? Okay. I think I'm just gonna call it. I'm just gonna call it for demon. Unless it was some really specific circumstances, that should have been an early hunt. Or it was, like, an exact 90-second hunt. Definitely no spirit, though. Uh, but this would be an insanely fast, quick money run here. It was a demon. There you go. So look at this. Now, that was obviously something we figured out pretty quickly. But demons are, ne are not necessarily the easy ghost to figure out. Look at that fucking money reward holy shit I, that was so much higher than i expected to see there what the hell that is four thousand two hundred from a six minute game which is pretty much like a small map uh time but because of and i didn't even get the bone i didn't even do all of the objectives that was far from perfect but the rewards are absolutely cracked because of it being a media map you get usually you get like around 150 for this now we get like an additional 60 or something because these maps give a much higher reward so yeah that was a good start we're going to be running it back and every time we're going to be seeing a different version of this map now first of all before we do anything we got to spin again and hope that we get a better chance for the believers this time uh, let's see how it goes. We get ourselves not a the demon this time. Okay. <laughs> Maybe two demons in a row, guys. <laughs> Come on, man. That's fucking rude. You're you're one game late. Come on, man. It's literally getting worse. 21 million this time. 9%? 2 million over here. Dude, the belie the doubters are insane today. 21 million doubters. Uh, well, in terms of points. Crucifix, Firelight, Ghost Event. Okay, so Ghost Event's not going to be up to us. Firelight and Crucifix will have to bring items, which we want to. Um, do you want to prioritize the objectives over doing, like, the bone and stuff? Because that only matters if you get a perfect game, which is basically never going to happen unless you um, like get a perfectly really close ghost room or something. Yeah, I ding dong this time, guys, for good luck. That means we're going to get a Believer win, right? You can turn that light on, by the way. Now, we don't have hiding spots, but it doesn't really matter because we got smudge ticks. So we can't go downstairs this time. Look, we're going to see different versions of this map every time. So this time, downstairs is blocked off. Where can we go? We cannot go left. We can only go right upstairs this time. Obviously, the middle here is always available um, every time. But now we only have the upstairs. This is such a creative thing that they did with this map. I would love to see more stuff like this. Like maybe, uh, like just media maps that are like blocked off sometimes so that you have a less <laughs> terrible experience on them. So you can actually still play like, cause I think this is a really fun way to allow uh, single players or like small teams to play on maps like this without having to deal with the pain and suffering that comes from the big sunny meadows. Um, did you just, you turn off the breaker, not a gin. It's also right next. It's right next to us. Do we have cleanse? We. I'm scared. It's like in the other room. I don't think it's right here. I'm not going to turn on my flashlight because it's going to kill me. It's not hunting, right? No, it's not hunting at all. It's just right in the room next door. But it's just not hunting at all. This is so strange. There we go. I think that's normal speed. That was so weird. That was so long with no hunt. Definitely not a demon, I would say, but you, I've seen weirder things, that's for sure. Um, okay, so we would like to smudge it here. At the end of the hunt, not at the start. Uh-oh. I think we can start going a little sicko mode. Hey there! It came out of here, right? No? Hey, ghost! 
Hey, peace! Okay, it's getting faster. It's definitely not a phantom. I'm gonna smudge it so we actually get the smudge. I smudged it at 1918. Okay. Uh, that was actually perfect smudge because you want to smudge it right before the end of the hunt. Was it in here? I don't know. I think I'm. Thank you for the ghost event. I appreciate it. Very cool. Um, I'm gonna leave my shit here except my uh, lighter. Also, we have the head cam so we can just walk back with no problem. Okay, so that gives us an, uh, an objective right there, which is nice. I don't know if you can get the lighter or the firelight objective by having it blow out a lighter. I don't think so. Uh, we could go for perfect game and see what the difference is between a perfect game and a, and a really quick game where you just figure out the ghost. As long as we can figure out the ghost here, because this might be a tricky one. Um, okay, so we want to go in there fast because it's already been a minute almost. We'll take maybe this... We would really like to have, you know what? We should actually set up for safety first. Let's do this. And then the firelight might as well take that too. So we have our, um, like if we find the ghost room here, can I turn this on please? Like if we know what the ghost room is, we can set some crucifixes and then like hopefully get some behavior maybe to happen. And it will also help us with the objectives. We can find the bone here and get a perfect game that way. I'm gonna hold on to a crucifix so we don't get insta-bopped here. So the ghost could hunt now. If it's normal. Gotta pick that shit up. Okay, it's not actually here, I don't think. Is this one? Yep! Alright, that should be in the right place. <laughs> we could set up for... Potential on the video. Jesus! Are you kidding me? Is that dirty water? Oh no. It's this fucking clock. Why is it making the bing? Fuck you. Is this a spirit? I mean, it could just be similar situation as last time, right? Okay, I don't know if this is... Is this the ghost room? There's no cold breath anywhere, right? Okay, I mean, I'm gonna guess it's here then. And move it in there. I just want you to blow out our candle. Okay, you're trolling me, dude. <laughs> now it's touching that door again. Are you fucking kidding me? So as long as we're on top of a crucifix, we can't get insta-killed by the no grace period. It can't be hallway, no. I'm just gonna leave that there for a second. Hold out my crucifix, or my smudge stick, I should say. So that we don't explode. Okay, wrong room. Oh, fuck. Could, I mean, this is kind of total hacks. Wait, I'm actually fine. Never mind. Goodbye. <laughs> There's like a, a sneaky glitch spot up there. I'm just gonna run away. They'll fix it one day. Uh, that was, was that spirit? That was possible to be spirit, but you don't know because like, it's definitely not a phantom. It's not an Oni because we had airball, right? Um, it's not a Revenant, not a Hantu, not a Moroi, Myling, Diothe. Obaka seems unlikely too. I think I can leave now. I didn't count that much at all. I didn't properly measure it. Not a Raichu, yeah. I really want to move this into the ghost room. Like, I guess the ghost room is next to it here. Okay, it's rotating a crucifix over there now. I just want to see the cold breath. I'm just going to guess this room. Uh, 
is ringing over there. I'm gonna leave my flashlight because I have this. Okay, we're safe. Uh, we really need another smudge stick. We need the salt for the wraith. This is a harder one. We're getting two in a row where it's pretty fucking hard. It's 60 seconds or 90 seconds already, really? Um, where it's pretty hard to figure out what the ghost is, honestly. Which is a good showcase. Should we time it again? I don't know, because we... there It might have used a crucifix, right? It blew out the candle or the firelight. Did you see that? Uh, that is a fucking insane amount of activity. Let's take the photo cam, this, and obviously another uh, smudge stick so we can keep ourselves safe. We might actually be able to... Get a perfect game if we can find the bone, which you already know the bone's gonna be here. Look at this. No bone. Fucking rude. Oh, door is still open. Dude, this ghost does not hunt at all, man. Is it just a spirit? Like, I don't know. This is weird. Ah! I'm dead. I smudge. I smudge. I'm dead. I've gotta die. Bro, get salted. I'm not gonna use the cheese spot because that would be hacks. I'm just gonna run and pray. Holy shit, I lived. Dude, tier three salt, actually insane. <laughs> tier three salt totally saved me there. <sighs> Goodness gracious, that, so what happened there? Oh no, am I dead? That's so fucked up, dude. I did that perfectly. That's so rude. <laughs> I played that about as good as anyone could have, and I still fucking die. I mean, obviously, so there's the spot there. I could show you in the next game. I just didn't want to use it right here because it would have felt. It would have taken away from that moment. We did get it correct, like though, because it was a fucking spirit, you peas. Okay, so that's too... I mean, spirit is relatively easy to figure out. The reason why this was such a hard spirit to figure out is because what you have to uh, keep in mind when you were dealing with uh, the smudge timer of ghosts is that ghosts have, like, a, a baseline activity rating, which also they have a baseline hunt, like how aggressive they are when it comes to hunts. And at the start of this game, we had like four minutes where it wasn't smudged, there was no crucifix, nothing, where it just didn't hunt at all. So that set the baseline for hunting at a really, really low rate. So the fact that it didn't hunt for three minutes after I smudged it didn't immediately make my alarms for spirit go off. Well, it did, but I couldn't use that as my only, uh, like my only data point to rule out or to make it to be certain that it was a spirit because we already knew that it was a really like passive ghost when it came to hunting so yeah that was i mean it wasn't four minutes but it was a really long fucking time uh but anyway that was a tragic disaster there almost survived though uh the believers did lose once again uh because the wheel is trolling you guys so <laughs> now we're gonna roll spirits <laughs> imagine okay will it be an odin right there Bro, this is kind of crazy. Another 21 million. 3 million this time, though, with two all-ins. Okay. The believers are strong, too, this time. We got Janice Dixon. Uh, repel, firelight, ghost event. All right. The repel is easy. I always like to see uh, cleanse as an objective because that allows you to do something kind of sneaky. Cleanse um, will tell you when you have smudged the ghost. Why is that so useful? Well... You can complete it during a hunt. Like, it's uh, it's pretty much... You can complete it in the same way you can complete Repel. However, if you find the Ghost Room before the hunt starts, you can decide to use your Smudge Stick to get, like, 90 seconds of safety. But you don't necessarily know if that will work. Like, if it worked, if you use the Smudge Stick. Because uh, sometimes the Ghost just ignores the Smudge Stick for some reason, or is, like, too far away from it. So having the objective will allow you to have a confirmation that it did in fact work and then you can decide to play it or use the 90 seconds um without risking just exploding yourself uh it's downstairs area again this time is it gonna be right side instead of left it is look at that we've seen three different versions of this already three different sunny meadows That's fast. 
Right? Twins? That's not Moroi fast, Dio or Thay fast. It can't be a Raichu, can't be a Revenant, can't be any of these guys. It's gonna kill me here. It could be a Hantu, that's what it... Okay, I think we're gonna see it one time. That might be risky though. It could be Mimic. It can't be Shade, why does that still open? It could be Hantu or it could be Twins. Turn off the light. Ghost event? It did a ghost event. Not sh it didn't touch me though. Too fast for twins? This is a bit of a risky area here. Oh, I love this place, it's fucking spooky. I don't think the ghost is... I mean, it could be over here. I'm just gonna sit back here, honestly. Because it cannot possibly have this be the ghost room, unless it, I guess it, the twins could hunt over here. I'm gonna have the trigger finger ready. I mean, it could do a ghost event and troll me. Um, we still want firelight. Repel is gonna be easy. I mean, we could skip the firelight. We don't have to get it. They sometimes do it themselves if they go up to the chapel and blow out a candle over there. Can you haunt me? You turning off the breaker? You bitch. Okay, that's rude. Um... It's still fast. So now we can see Hantu breath, but I don't think it's a Hantu. Hello! Hello! Oh, it's a crowdy bitch! Okay, so much that uh, 33, seven. Holy scary. Hello! I would like to see if it could speed up. Is that- there's no way that's a Moroi, right? Moroi would be so much faster. <laughs> nice motor, I'm gonna pick that up. We could go for perfect. Yeah, this is messed up. Okay, let's just leave our shit here for now, because I don't really know. We're gonna put on... Sneaky hat cam. We have a timer for spirit going. Um, I feel like that's faster, but it's not very fast. Like, it's definitely no Thay. It's obviously no Dio. Revenant is off the table. Um, so it would come down to twins, which would be easy because we just have to wait for it to change speed during the hunt. Um, but we don't... Like, you can get really unlucky with that, and it never does it. So let's take this. Crucifix just to play it safe. And then we could take salt for pictures as well, but man. I mean, Mimic would always be a possibility. That was two hunts where it was the same speed, though, I think. Still not hunting. I think it's been almost 90 seconds now. Should be 90 seconds now, yeah, indeed. Get me in here. Don't you dare. I need to grab that so much fast. Okay, turn that shit off. Place it. Turn that off too. I'm a little scared. I could place it as triple. Triple salt just for the for the pictures. It's not hunting still. Is it gonna be another fucking spirit? There's no way, right? Okay, it's all the way back there. Now what you have to keep in mind is that zero gray spirit makes for a really scary situation. Okay, it's throwing stuff over there. Could walk around with this. Can you give us a sign? I would love to get that crucifix to work right about now. Still not hunting.
it has a 250 on the timer. I could totally die here if it... Does this sound normal now? You know what we could try to figure out more, right? Is take sanity pills during the hunt. Yeah, that is kind of scary. You hear that? It's doing squishy, stinky noises. Okay, stop hunting. I really want to have you stop hunting now. It sounds like it's coming from this one, but this is so close to the entrance. I want to see if it cold. it's cold breath. No cold breath. Okay, this door. Wait, we can actually try for pictures, right? It... Excuse me. Oh, it's cold breath in the fuck on the hall. Okay, keep searching that door. I want to try pictures. Also, we have this. One. You could take this one. I don't know if that's going to count. Let me get the fuck out of here. Okay, perfect. Leave that there for now as well. Did we get those pictures or do we have to delete something? Two-star interaction! Luckily, we can delete. Okay, it's hunting again. Uh, this ghost is being insanely annoying when it comes to... <laughs> when it comes to the crucifix. And it's like all over the place. Maybe a thermo might actually be useful. I really want to know if it's fast again. I'm going to delete this guy. Well, actually, we don't have to yet, because if we're not going to go for perfect, we can keep it. This cannot be twins, right? It has to be Moro, I guess. Is the Moro really this much of a little bitch? I thought Moros were fast as hell. I guess we'll just try pills. I swear this sounds like little baby mode. Moros are scary, or they're supposed to be. Okay, let's see. It can't be a Thay. Thay would be way faster. I mean, maybe I've just played it too many high speeds recently. Uh, I guess what we're gonna do, so we can take two sanity pills with us, which will give us 40% sanity if we use both of them right away. Uh, we can also bring this, because we still have a smudge stick in there. We can use this both for pictures as well as the objective. The objective is more important right now, as long as we're not going for perfect game yet, or if we don't have it yet. Uh, Jesus Christ, this guy is uh, a little mad. So what we can do is if we hear the ghost, I'm going to spam this, um, these sanity pills, and then listen if it gets slower. It's blinking. It's actually a Moroi! Wow! That's like genuinely surprising to me. I really, really thought Moros were faster. Okay. Uh, so yeah, that, that was... I made that much harder on myself than it should have been because I just could not possibly believe that was a Mora. Um, we're gonna place that... I think it is just actually Squishy Room or some shit. I'm gonna place that right there. I could also do it during a hunt. Uh, we have a little bit of safety, but not much. I would love to get a smudgeon on this. Possible. Can you give us a sign? I blew out the candle already, or what? I'm gonna take that picture. Did that count? Okay. Wait, we need to get that crucifix. Where did I place it? Placed it earlier, right? Could I just smudge? I'm gonna go insane. I'm smudging. I'm praying that I hit the ghost. This might be stupid. I might regret this. Uh, I hope that worked. And then we take pictures. Is this not the place you take the picture? Okay, there we go. Uh, could you give us a sign? I hope that worked. Where's my crucifix? There. Place this in the ghost room. Can you give us a sign? Show yourself. Oh, hi. That worked. <laughs> okay. Wait, wait. Delete the... Delete this one. Wait, what? It leaves, it leaves an empty space. I didn't know it did it like that. It blew it out again. Uh, light it again. Yes. And then we need three more. Can you give us a sign? Show yourself. Do something. Give me a sign. The crucifix should also help us. Come on. This is so risky. You should never do this. I just really want to see what a perfect game is on this difficulty and this map. Come on. Do something. Show yourself. Do something. Give us a sign. You bees? Blow out the candle. Don't hunt outside. I need to not have my photo cam out. 
Because we could, this is so risky. We might genuinely die for this one. Um, come on, use the crucifix. That would be fine. Then we get two pictures. Did it touch this door again? I think it touched back there. Oh, this is fucked. Uh, stay in this room. I think it's time for us to go. I think, no, we used the sanity pill, but that doesn't matter because we're still below 50. Get me the fuck out of here. Don't you dare close this door. Okay. Um, we could. This is so risky, though. <laughs> we could go back. Let's just grab a fucking smudge stick. Let's not be stupid. Let's just take a smudge stick. It is still not hunting. All right, I'm going to leave one smudge here for a second. Throw in the salt. It used the crucifix. Okay, wait, that means we have a, a little bit of safety. Wait, wait, that's huge. Uh, we just need to hit, get it. Uh, step in a little bit of this. All right, boom, boom, boom. Place that in front. My photo cam, I dropped around here. As long as we don't instantly explode, we should be fine. Uh, I only need one smudge for now. I want this photo, and then I want you to step on the salt, and then I'm out of your face. Light it. That's there we go. Alright, I should probably go. This is stupid. Alright, step in the salt, please. I'm gonna hold on to this for now. It used it again. Wait, that's two pictures if we can get there fast, and we have 20 25 seconds to do this. Because it shouldn't be able to insta hunt right after. Or we can take this and then this. And then we're out of here, right? That's perfect game. Okay, so that was obviously very time in intensive, so this probably shouldn't be done. <laughs> Like, it's not necessarily worth it. Um, but I just wanted to see how much the difference is. So we had, for a game that had only two objectives, we got 4,000. This game is perfect. We'll see how much the difference is going to be between perfect and two objectives. There we go. And the reward is 5.3. Okay, so that is 1,100 more than just doing two objectives that's kind of crazy i mean it's definitely if you compare that like that was twice as long right so twice as long for uh like a 25 percent increase is not the best tactical play but look at that money though the money doesn't lie that's kind of crazy but if you can snag like if you can get a a quick perfect game that would be like definitely worth it all right anyway we're gonna respin not an oni that time um, we'll get lucky one of these days. Don't worry guys. You're totally gonna get your comeuppance. Will it be a banshee? So far we've seen three out of the five different iterations of Sunny Meadows Restricted, which is kind of cool Hopefully we'll get to see them all. We have 19 million this time. Banshee 19 million one all in We'll see how that goes uh, Christopher Carey Firelight escape and repel those are decent I think the worst version of this map is the one where you have the middle because the kitchen is just so bad. I don't even know if it allows you to go all the way to the kitchen. We don't have downstairs. Uh, we have right side. Okay, so did, we've already seen this one, but obviously we're going to see repeats because there's only a few different versions. Actually, yeah, because this is blocked off already hunting and it's not back here. So it's in this area. It's gonna be miling. Or it's gonna be. We have been pretty unlucky when it comes to ghost rooms, by the way, because a lot of the time when I did this before, I would get ghosts in the chapel or at the entrance as well. So this is kind of like the worst case scenario, and you're still getting insanely high reward. Uh you're we're still getting insanely high rewards relatively quickly. Um so I'm I'm promising you, you that you can do this even faster and get even more money. There we go. Uh, I don't think that it was anywhere in the, in the entrance here. So it's going to be all the way at the back, which there's not really that many good hiding spots back there. But we have two smudge sticks. I could show you this now. Like this could have saved me that last or the few rounds ago where I decided to run that way. And I got super unlucky by the ghost finding me back there. There's like still a problem with this, the way that this is placed. The ghosts are fat shamed here and they cannot go through this. Like their pathing doesn't allow them to squeeze through this hole. So we can go back and forth here. If I'm standing over here, 
the ghost will walk one path this way. If I'm standing over here, the ghost cannot go through here. It wants to go around. So what you can do is you can stand right here. The ghost is going to go this way. I can step right here before it reaches me. And then it wants to go back. And then I can go back here. It goes back around. I go back here. It goes back around. And you just keep ping-ponging it back and forth between this. Now, it is risky because the ghost will be speeding up all the time. So it's easy to mess up. Um, but yeah, it's a, it's a little cheesy. That's why I didn't want to use it that time, but I can show you. Uh, they should just fix it. I don't know why they haven't fixed it. It should be so simple. What the fuck? Wait. It's a miling! Excuse me? It's gotta be miling right in your shit. It's like back there. Wait, what? <laughs> Excuse me? Because I heard a throw there. But I didn't hear any ghosts. Mimic miling incoming. We need to get the... We need to get the repel. Should be a little further away. Let's just flick this light switch. If we really can't hear it from here. Here, it should be a miling. Oh. Oh, never mind. It's a hantu. Unless? Wait, is it? Wait, there you go! Wait, is it a mile or a mimic? You see that shit? So this is the cheese. I mean, obviously I have too much like right now, so I don't need to do any of this, but... You just go back and forth, because they can't squeeze by. Okay, this is kind of weird. Now, this is a pretty decent spot to take ghost photos. Um, we could try and just... Wait, 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 wait. I really shouldn't drop my lighter. That's always stupid, because you might lose it. Um, we could try and, like, speed run a perfect game here. Like, with the new photo deletion, we don't have to do this, but it's obviously still a really fast way of getting a perfect game by just placing down three salt. And then trying to squeeze in a ghost photo. I think it might have changed or it might just be a Hantu. Uh, the breaker can only be here because there's no other spot available with this gen or this version of Sunny Meadows. Uh, maybe I should leave it off actually because we can see. No, because we will know, right? Because it's not going to speed up. I think what we're going to do is two of this in photo cam. And then I guess go back for a third salt. So... We just, we could just place it back here. Place one, two, three. Crucifix, I don't care. And then the other salt. I have one smudge, that's all I want. And then we'll just bait it through here, get it to step in all the salt, which is nine pictures, remember? <laughs> it's just ridiculous. Oh, there it's something. Now we only have one smudge here, so we should be a little careful. I don't have my flashlight either, which is a little annoying. Hello? I guess I could pick it up. I like the flashlight more than this. It's also gonna glitch out. Ghost? Still back. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, it's still a Hantu. I'm sorry, gamers. I'm sorry to the believers. I need to be careful that I cannot switch my items when I'm taking a picture, so I'm just gonna do the smudge and then run and then just play it safe over here and try to get the ghost photo okay let's see can we get this i did not get it okay uh luckily oh we need to get firelight still uh we can just delete it but we can only do that we can only do that one more time which means i, I forgot about the firelight one two three one two Three, one, two, three. <laughs> That's so fucking stupid. Could we do this, actually? Does anyone know if this counts? If I stand in the ghost room with my lighter and it blows out my lighter, will that give me... I don't even need the ghost foot. I could just take this. Will that count? I could just... It was this one, right? 
It was. It does. Lower my candle. Give me a sign. Is it in the other room now? It should be cold. I have so little time. Give me a sign. Show yourself. Hey, you peach. Do it. Do it right now. If I get hunted here, I'm so dead. Because it like there's no grace period. So I get instantly blown up. <laughs> Does anyone have a timer? I have no timer. Did that count? No, it didn't count. Okay, well, that's for science right there. So lighter does not count. <laughs> that's firelight. Noted, noted. So you need to actually put a candle there. That would be cool. I don't know why that doesn't count. I guess because it's not technically called a firelight. Did we already get the bone? We didn't, right? Um, but the bone is going to be in one of these rooms. I think that is a perfect showcase of why this map isn't on the same scale as prison. The difference between finding the bone on prison and finding the bone on this map is just night and day. Like, finding it on prison is like a once in a... Like, once in 20 game kind of happening. Whereas here, if you just look around a little bit, you should be able to find it no problems. Why are you doing this to me? Bro, these hunts are long though. There we go. That's fine. Uh, we could even reduce the length of the hunt somewhat without really tanking our reward, I think. Uh, is it going to be in the chapel? That would actually be pretty annoying because the chapel is kind of large. Most of the time you just find... Oh, there it is. It wasn't the chapel, but it wasn't that hard. So we picked that up. Now, I don't think... I mean, we lose out on the entire bunch. Let's just look at the difference. So, I know we're, we're missing out on the perfect game bonus now because we didn't, uh... Well, actually, because we want the final objective. Because we already know what we get with two. Alright, let's just... Oh my god, you're kidding me? We're just gonna quickly drop in a candle and we should be... Should be good to go with the perfect game. Alright, here you go. I'm just gonna leave that there. You can touch it if you want. I really hope you do. Uh, and I'm gonna be out of here. Goodbye. Did you touch my candle? You did not. How about you do that? Oh, there we go. It did it. All right. We were just about to bring another one because it was taking too long, but we got it. All right. So that is definitely not worth the <laughs> But I just like to have the perfect game because it's nice to get all the money from it. Uh, get me the fuck out of here. That should be an easy haunter. So the reason you could see the breath, by the way, was because it was a haunter. Uh, the haunter has that. If the breaker is off, it'll show the, the freezing breath. There you go. It was indeed a Hantu. And once again, 5,300, which is a level at this stage. We're almost level 90, which unlocks the final items here. Uh, almost level 6 prestige in general. Uh, that was a 50-minute game. 50 minutes is not that long. I mean, you, doing a prison game, unless you get l lucky, is usually going to be like 20 minutes or something. Um, the bone was indeed in the chapel. All right. Well, let's hope we... We get a lucky wheel here. Come on. Give us an easy ghost as well. Demon. Another one. That's like three demon spins in like five rounds or something. All right. Now we're, you already know what map we're going to be playing. Sunny Man is restricted. Let's go. We're still getting all ins over here. One all in. And 18 million doubters. Goodness. In terms of amounts, it's actually, look at that. 750 believers. 740 doubters. So in terms of numbers the believers are winning uh motion sensor firelight again dude can we stop with these fucking objectives we like what you really want to see when it comes to objectives i gotta put that shit on is the like easy hunt objectives like cleanse repel escape um stuff like that but we've been getting unlucky was that a fucking instant poltergeist excuse me Holy shit! I think so. <laughs> Wait, what? Or it was twins? No way, dude. I walked in and it blasted right away. Okay, wait, we can leave this here and bring in a crucifix? <laughs> that's the way, no way. I'm just gonna go. That would be so funny if that's actually correct. <laughs> no way. That would be the fastest Sunny Meadows run of all time. Literally two seconds. Oh my god. <laughs> that's so good. No way, dude. That's, that's that was three thousand 
That actually is like borderline the fastest you could possibly do a map like that. <laughs> you walk in, get an instant interaction identifying the ghost, and boom, you're out. And that's a 10 times multiplier, 43 second long game. That is actually cracked. <laughs> Holy shit, 3,000 experience for that. That is fucking nasty. Now, obviously, we could have stuck around to get some more objectives, but I, I wanted to see just how fast we could go. That's crazy, 43 seconds. All right, well, sorry to the believers. That was freaking brutal right there. Uh, let's uh, <laughs> let's spin again. You lost everything in 43 seconds. I'm sorry. <laughs> Life comes at you fast sometimes. <laughs> Will it be a mare? That was that was a brutal experience for sure. I did. We didn't even know what version of the map that was. Uh, so that that's a good example, by the way. So 3,000 is with no objectives 4000 is with two objectives and 5000 if you do all of the stuff including the perfect game 20 million what the hell 20 million and 2.6 here with an all in still though and the believers are only getting stronger so that's 50 more this time almost six or 60 basically all right uh april cleanse pair mic repel okay cleanse repel is really easy pair mic not so much but that's fine i also forgot to upgrade my crucifix uh because we that game was so fast <laughs> we gotta do that the tier three crucifix is actually so fun that it allows you to stop um like cursed hunts is really nice in some situations not all of them but some of them uh, we can't go downstairs we can only go left which we haven't had so far that's a boner right there i'm gonna leave that so we can take the picture later. Hello? Come this way. There we go. Wait, are you fucking... Little baby! That was smudge. Smudge the 1020. Okay. Um... That was normal speed, but it did seem like it could be a yokai potentially because it didn't find me right away. But I don't know. Maybe I just wasn't close enough. Baby mare. We'll see. Uh, we have a little bit of safety. There. Hopefully the ghost room is going to be close. Out of all the way back in. So look at that. We have two objectives already. We want a crucifix if we can find it. This is always going to be good. Uh, Paramike, I guess just for the objectives. Because we still have one smudge in there. Uh, I forget the thing again. I gotta get this so we can walk back easier. It's still, it's much worse now because you can't use it during a hunt anymore because it will glitch out now. But I mean, for just walking, it's gonna be pretty good. Hello, ghost. We, it's been a 60 seconds. I'm just gonna leave this here for the moment. Leave that or take the picture i guess there and then we'll just focus on actually being able to protect ourselves with the crucifix and the smudges there was a throw in this room is it here hello okay it should be able to hunt i think it was in there in 10 seconds here or already at this point actually Hopefully it's gonna use my crucifix. I'm gonna take it did not use my crucifix. But there's a 50% chance for it to come here again because it saw me here during the last hunt. I could try to get a uh, whisper during a hunt. Okay, uh, did not get a whisper, sadly. That's so funny, dude. What's so funny? So it wasn't this one? Hold here. I think it was further. Oh, there you go. 
Get it, get it, get it. Was this one, I think? Was it this one? We can try it. I don't know if it touched that just now. Maybe it was the next one, actually. I think it's too late. Now, I want to try to take this door picture, though. Okay, take the door picture. That count. Three star, take two of these. One, two. Give me a sign. Show yourself, you piece. You just need pair, Mike. Give me a sign. Show yourself. We are safe on this crucifix. Uh, we did not smudge there, so that wasn't... That was early enough for it not to be a spirit, for sure. Uh, also, that's not a shade because it hunts in the same room. Uh, it's a door again. I'll take another picture. It's fun to try and go for perfect, though, even though it's not technically optimal. It's still... I mean, it makes you feel more... The optimal way to play is the most fun way, right? And perfect games is pretty fucking fun. Also, you're just spamming interactions. I appreciate it. Oh, that's that thing. Can you give us a sign? Thank you! Okay, um... Uh, we just need one more picture. Do one more thing. Three, two... Thank you! Is that gonna count? Oh, you son of a bitch! Oh, you threw something else? I'm gonna smudge. I'm gonna smudge. I'm gonna smudge. That better count. What did you just throw? I don't know. Throw something else. I'm gonna delete it. Wait, it threw something again. It threw this again? Can I pick it up? Fuck. Oh, there we go. Yeah! <laughs> Get me out of here. Okay. Um. So we smudged it. I didn't take a proper timer. But we have no more smudge sticks right now, so we need to play it safe. Okay, so we got that. We got all the pictures. Pretty neat. Neat. Now we need to actually figure out what the fuck this ghost is. Okay, that helps. Nice. We got all objectives, but we don't know what this ghost is. <laughs> that's good. That's that's not how you usually play the game. Thirty seconds. Okay, if you guys keep timers, that's perfect. Thank you. How many door touches was that? Yeah, it went kind of crazy on the door. We need to get. It's like we need to test so many things during a hunt. We could grab this. I kind of want to check for salt as well, though. Instead, have a smudge always. Um, and then salt we check for wraith, but I don't really think it's gonna be a wraith because otherwise it would have already like teleported to our location earlier. It could totally be a mare. I'm just gonna leave some stuff here and take a, a firelight. If it just stays in that ghost room, that would be incredible because that means we can check for on Rio uh, really easily. It doesn't really done any ghost events, so maybe no Oni. It's 90 seconds now or 80 seconds. Okay, uh, let's just take this for Mimo. This and another one. And then we're good. We don't need to do motion sensor or anything. much stick right here we're totally safe so it should hunt basically right now because we don't have a crucifix or anything in there i'm gonna leave this for the moment just need to play it safe if we get this crucifix in there even if it uses it once that's not that big of a deal and with this much we should be able to stay safe it was back here right don't you dare okay get that in there and we run Hold on to your smudge for dear life. Probably gonna use it. Not yet. It did use it. Okay, so now hopefully we're gonna get this on top of the crucifix before the next hunt. Otherwise, we're in trouble. Because we were, we were testing for on Rio here. Please don't use it. Please don't use it. It's rotating crucifixes. Don't do it. Okay, perfect. So now if it uses... Ring, ring. Look at that. Crucifix upside down. Can you give us a sign? We're totally ready. Ray, we don't have salt. I need to stay here because now if it blows out the candle... Or if it uses the crucifix and then blows out the candle right after, we won't know that. So we gotta stick here. Can you give me a sign? I can do that too. There was a time when this map first came out that we could also click on crucifixes and rotate them, but that was a bug, and then they got rid of it instead of just embracing that that was a really fun thing. Especially if you could turn it back around. That would be kind of interesting. 
like fight with the ghost. I like the effect. You see that like scratchy effect on the wall where the ghost rotated it. Can you give us a sign? Come on. Use the crucifix and I'm no, 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 no. Maybe it isn't on Rio. Suddenly it's not hunting anymore. Okay, there we go. Never mind. All right. No on Rio. Get me out of here. Oh, Jesus. Baby. Crazy baby. Jesus Christ. Okay. No on Rio. No Dio. No Moroi. Did it get faster? No Revenant. They... I don't think I was a phantom either. And just hold on to this. Play some salt as well. Yeah, we just need to get like more v hi oh fuck brother i can't really fucking see this thing definitely getting faster much Much at 1930. Ah, it's rest. Bro. Okay. Uh, not a phantom. Not a wraith. We didn't really test for Jin there. Was it Oni? Was that far enough away for Jin? Is the breaker even on? The breaker isn't even on, so it can't be a Jin because we never turn it off. Um, so that's easy. Now that goes was kind of fucking scary. Uh, what else can we rule out? We can rule out Haunter because it was getting faster. Miling, Raichu, Obake most likely. That would be really unlucky. Twins. No Oni? Probably. I mean, it could totally be a mare here. Mare is very possible. So then we would have to use... Well, three guys, I feel like we would have heard more throws, right? I think so. We could try to set up some shit here. I don't think it's not. I don't think it's so guys. Because the books make a very weird like that sound now and you hear that so much if the poltergeist comes to the chapel did you just throw that book there in the back i think that might have been the shadow um this oh hello I don't think it's a yokai. Hello, hello, hello. Immediately came in here. I don't think it's a poltergeist. I don't think that's a yokai. Uh, I feel like demon is almost off the table because of the... I mean, it did use the crucifixes a lot. Banshee is hard to tell. We didn't get a scream. We could just... I think it's time to... I mean, we could also test for Banshee that, or a demon that way. I think it's time to take three sanity pills, which is gonna put us at 60, then drop a little bit more sanity and... Oh, hello there. And test for Mare here. Are you fucking... That's just rude. <laughs> Come on, man. All right, get me the hell out of here. Um, So three sanity pills. One, two, three. And then, we don't really have anything. We just want to listen for, like, everything is already. Um, we just want to listen for potential Banshee screams. I don't think it's going to be able to do the Yure ability from that far away if we're not close to the ghost. I just really hope that it's going to uh, hunt soon and be a mare. Not only would that be a Believer win, but it would also help me out quite a lot. 
I'm just gonna have to wait for it though. A little bit. I want to stay in the light. I guess we're already low enough for Mare now, right? So then we just keep the light on here and we just stand in this in this room. Did you really turn off the breaker again? You fucked it. I mean, this could totally be a mare. Because recently I've been getting a lot of mares to just non-stop turn off the... The breaker. Even though it shouldn't be doing that. Like, it shouldn't really be, uh... Related to it being a mare. But it's just been happening a lot to me. What's this say? Rules for nurses. Hello, whisper. Uh, that's two whispers. What do we got? All nurses... Must ever remember that Sunny Meadows Mental Institution is for the care of mentally sick persons who are not always responsible for their acts or words and woe welfare and whose welfare is always first considered blah, blah, uh, to be considered that the patients are always to be treated kindly. No restraints is to be applied except in extreme emergency without the knowledge and consent of the medical officer in case of something differences arising between patient and nurse. Do not try to argue or use force, but send for the chief nurse or other officer who will decide what shall be done. Yeah, they are totally ethical and stuff. Have you seen the downstairs section where there's been like freaking people cut open in brutal, brutal fucking experiments? You liars. It's a front. I mean, it's not hunting right now, which makes me think it's probably not a mare. I'm sorry, gamers. Another whisper. Okay, so no demon, that's for sure. I don't think it's a mare. Uh, that seems unlikely now. Because otherwise it would have already happened. Then that's three whispers, so probably no banshee. Um, I really need... Oh, man, if it just screams. Just give me something easy. I don't think it's a mare, though. Fuck. I guess we're gonna get closer. We could take another sanity pill and stay closer for longer. I have a smudge, right? Yes, I do have a smudge. Um, can you give us a sign? Are you still in this room? Because if you're still in this room, you're probably... Probably a Gorio. It's still cold breath in here? I mean... What door was that? It could totally be like a Yure or some bullshit, but I think this is like one of those situations where we probably got to say Gorio. Because it did a ghost of it all the way over fucking here. It was all over the place. And then it's still just in that room. Like, I hate this specific... This specific, like, three ghosts in no evidence. Because no matter how well you play, you will always just have a chance to get bamboozled and there is like nothing you could do. Uh, cause we got three whispers, right? Every single whisper is a 30% chance for it to be a scream if it is a banshee. So that would be really fucking unlucky if all three of those was not a scream and it's still being a banshee, but it is possible. Mare, I think is like borderline, we could totally rule that out, like, cause Based on, yeah, now our sanity is already this low. So Mare is definitely not possible. Demon is definitely not possible. Mimic seems almost entirely impossible because of the, like, the same hunting behavior every hunt. Although, that would be a spicy. I didn't check for orbs, but I'm not going back. Now I think I'm just calling it being a Gorio. Shouldn't be a Banshee because we didn't get any screams. And then this is always the, like, absolute hell of a guess. Where, if it never roams, this is, you just gotta apply the decision tree here. If it never roamed... And you've been there for a while. You got to go with Gorio because if you say Yure and it ends up being a Gorio, you were stupid because you had the only evidence for Gorio, which is that it doesn't roam. Whereas if you um, pick Gorio and it ends up being a Yure, you can just be like, well, unlucky that it never changed ghost room. So um, I'm just going to go for the choice that makes me feel the least stupid when it's wrong. Um, and also the most likely, but it's like a 65% chance versus a 35% chance. Uh, but we got it this time, and that's why you always run it that way, because we could have felt real fucking stupid if we did it the other way. So this is a totally, like, holy shit. 
Oh, because of the <laughs> because of the weekly, I was like, "What the fuck is this? That is an insanely high reward." Um, this is not really a, a good showcase, though, because that was a twenty-minute game. Honestly, twenty million or twenty million? <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking as a doubter right now. Um, twenty minutes for a Gorio no evidence challenge on like imagine this on prison. Imagine having to do no evidence, no sanity Gorio on prison. You would never get that. You would just have to eventually guess and like hope you're correct uh so yeah that that could have been a whole lot worse is what i'm trying to say anyway uh let's see if we will get finally lucky when it comes to the at least we got lucky when it came to the gorio guess will we also get lucky when it comes to the believers uh hopefully raichu will it be a raichu that will be very obvious right away let's do it 18 million versus 2.6 with two all-ins all right let's go uh, and I also quickly went back to upgrade my crucifix. So now we have the tier three. Uh, Ghost event, EMF, parabolic microphone. Okay, those are pretty elaborate um, objectives, but whatever. Maybe we'll get a lucky ghost. It mostly depends if it's going to be close to the entrance here. Also a ding for good luck. We haven't had any... I mean, we had that entrance poltergeist, which was like the 40 minute or 40 second game gonna be right side again don't hunt already please let me in please let me in you suck hello oh door touch do you hear that is it a miley i could hear the door but no footsteps i can hear the throws what miley I'm hearing throws and door touches, but no ghosts. This has to be a miling. Right? I mean, maybe? I don't know. Let's just, let's actually do a proper hunt. Where were those throws? That really matters here. Uh, nice boner right away. I'm just going to pick that up. I don't think we're going to be. Maybe we'll stick around for a perfect game. Um... It was that? No way. Wait, it was really over here? And we didn't hear the footsteps from there? That's gotta be Miling. Uh, oh, but it's touching all the way out there now. EMF, Ghost of Imperamite. Can you give us a sign? Um, is that blinking lights? The lights are blinking over there, but I think that's just because of the... shit being old. Hello? We could do the the cheese here. You turn on the light in there. I'm gonna smudge your ass. I'm gonna smudge. Smudge at uh, 34. Okay. I don't know if that hit, but I'm gonna assume it did. I'll leave this here. Uh, we could quickly get EMF and EMF uh, photo cam in here. I don't really see this being a perfect game, but at least if we can do the objectives, that'll help out. Hello, Gaber. I have a crucifix. Perfect. Okay, we should be fine now. Uh, throw this. That's EMF. That's all we wanted. And then definitely hold this. I want to stand back here. Unless it hunts from there, in which case I'm dead. But what are the chances? I think even at that range, the tier 3 crucifix might save us. Yeah, if it's a normal ghost, it should be able to hunt now. What the fuck? Okay, there goes our paramic. <laughs> Can you give us a ghost of it? Hello? I still, we still don't know for sure if this is a miling or not. Did I turn this on? I don't remember turning on this light. Can you give us a sign? This ghost loves to turn on lights. I want you to do a ghost event. That will be amazing. Close this door and just be here. It's not cold in here, so... How to do that? Beep, beep, beep. Uh, can you share yourself? Can you do something? Can you give us a sign? I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it and run. Take it and run, and then we'll just stand. Okay, so if it's gonna hunt from there, I'm just gonna be. I'm just scared that it's gonna do some stupid like. Like it's just gonna find me really fast, and then we'll die. Turn on the hallway. Turn on hallway lights. Because if it's a miling, we don't have to do much. We just have to. 
be somewhat close to the ghost and listen. Uh, how did you do that? Excuse me. You peace? I put that so far away. All right, well, <laughs> the power of the tier three crucifix is actually painful. Maybe it roamed to me. Why didn't you do a ghost event then? It's just like, I mean, it's not that much bigger than the tier two, but it's super good. Demon, potentially. We'll keep it in mind. That was kind of weird. I still think Myling is most likely. Oh, it's hunting. Bro. Hello? That's my... Is that not my link? I mean, it sounds hard, loud when we're close. You wanna smudge it here and then run away. If that's not Myling, then I'm gonna lose my mind. That's gotta be Myling. Can you fucking not kill me though? I think we're good. Uh, I'm gonna get the hell out of here. That's extremely quiet, even at a really cro close range. I mean, obviously when it got like at the loop spot here, it was loud as fuck, but that doesn't really count. There you go. It was a Myling. That, I mean, it's harder on the bigger maps to do milings because the sounds are slightly different. Look at that, 4,000. Uh, we got two objectives again because the Coast Avengers didn't happen, not really up to us. And that was a seven minute game. So if you like to see big numbers, and I mean, this is um, a relatively difficult challenge, right? Zero sanity, zero evidence, no grace period, but it is totally doable. And you even technically have 20% sanity pills. So what you could do if you wanted to play this in a different way, you could just start the game, take all the sanity pills, be at 80% sanity. And then I started somewhat safe i like to start it with hunts right away because when you're playing zero evidence most of the information is going to come from the hunts anyway so it doesn't really benefit you that much to have sanity but um if you want to play it that way you could come on we really need to get that uh the same energy when it comes to believer wins though dio we haven't had a dio in a little while so maybe this will be the chosen one who knows you got 17 million or 16 and a half over here. Uh, wait, look at the amount though. Only 600 versus there's like 125 more believers. Where did the doubters go? The doubters went to bed. The doubters are snoozing right now. They're snoozing on their piles of channel points from all the games that they've won. Oh, fuck. Fine. Is it gonna it's gonna be the middle version? It is okay, so this is I think the worst one. Dio No it's fast though Come on man It's not fast enough and it's not finding me Is it more? I think this might be a thing because it didn't get any faster, huh? Uh, I just, I think I hit it at the end, did I? I don't know if I did. It blew out the thing. Um, whoops, I'm going too far. So it's in the kitchen somewhere. Probably they. That was actually, that was like the perfect speed for, I mean, potentially, I think a Dio is slightly faster. Uh, only for our dreams to be crushed by it not finding us. Could still be Mimic though. You never know. Uh, so what is our plan here? I guess just take a sanity pill or two during the hunt. What are our objectives? We mostly want those. Photo of the ghost. That's risky as fuck. I think we're just gonna take one sanity pill then. Because that should already tell us the difference. Like if it doesn't get any slower. With uh, one sanity pill. It's, it's a little less noticeable though. Leave that there for now. And then we have our smudge. 
think it's probably gonna be too far away. We should be oh, somewhat safe just sitting back here. Uh, but we should grab our stuff. If it does a ghost event all the way out here. I was planning to just take the ghost photo during a hunt. But what's really annoying now... I really hate this change. It's such a lazy and stupid change. Um, basically, they had some issues with photo cams. If you took a picture and then immediately toggled your inventory, that led to a few issues. So they just made it so that you can't toggle your photo cam anymore while taking a picture, which is horrible for gameplay. Like, it just means... I didn't realize you were hunting. Because it means taking a photo during a hunt is just extremely painful now. We gonna whisper? Hey! Come this way! Should take the pill, but I forgot to bring it. Hey, a bitch! Okay, I'm gonna try it once. I guess I could just take a bunch of pictures if I only... Did I get it? Oh, come on! Really? <laughs> Out of all of those, I didn't get lucky? Hey, at least we can try 12 times <laughs> to get this. Okay, so what we do now... This is actually, um... Really good. So now the ghost saw us, right? Which means next hunt, there's a 50% chance that it'll straight run back here. Uh, which will give us more chance to take pictures. Which will be nice. And I'm also gonna take the sanity pill this time. To potentially... Figure out if it- or to figure out if it's a moral or not. So this can only really be- I think this is stay. This sounds fast as hell. So no Dio, I'm sorry. I'm gonna rule out. Could still technically be a mimic, but that's some heavy copium right there. Jesus Christ. We should also, we could use the, um... Yeah. Oh, it's already coming! Perfect! Wait, hello? It's still fast. Didn't change at all. Come this way! Come this way! Hello, hello! Hello, hello, hello! Bro! Okay, so it's gotta be a thing. Alright, whatever. We're not gonna get the ghost photo. Shit's gonna be annoying anyway. We might die. Uh, we're getting the fuck out of here. We know that's gonna give us 4,000. 4, which is big monies. It keeps turning off the damn breaker. It really hates that. Um, now, it could age during a hunt, but it has to be close to you. So the way that the day works is that it will set a random timer between one to two minutes, I think. Uh, and then if you're close to it, it'll get older. Otherwise, it'll do 30 seconds. Uh, wait another 30 seconds to try again. If you're then not close to it still, it'll do another 30 seconds, try again. Etc. 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 So if you're close to the thay for at least 30 seconds at a time, you're usually gonna make it one stage older at least. Uh, if there's some time between that, uh, obviously, because if you just made it older, it'll wait for one to two minutes instead. Um, but that can even happen during hunts. So if you loop the ghost for 30 seconds during a hunt, it'll be older by the next hunt. I don't know if it actually slows down during that hunt too. That takes so long to tick up. Look at that though, 93. How long was that? That was only a five minute game. Like these are the games. This is why I think it's better to just go for the fast ones instead of the um, the perfect games. I mean, this was obviously also a really easy one because we had a Thay, uh, which honestly doesn't sound as fast as I remember. I thought the Thays were faster. Anyway, um, we're still gonna get, <laughs> we're still gonna keep spinning. The doubters are definitely having a great time today. Will it be a Wraith? We haven't seen a Wraith today. Wraiths are actually really scary with zero uh, grace period because it can teleport on top of you and then instantly kill your ass. We have 15 and a half million versus... It's the exact same amount this time versus 2.8 with almost three all-ins. 720. Wait, this is literally pretty much the exact same amount of believers and doubters. Come on. Uh, Bradley, motion sensor, firelight, escape. Escape is easy, but the other ones are a little... 
a little annoying. But we just have to place a motion sensor. The plan depends on where the ghost is. If the ghost is close, they won't be problems. Fast again? That's not good. Another Dio, though. Is that another thing? Hey, you bitch! Come this way. Hey, bitch! I don't want to. Hey, bitch! Much. Oh, whatever. Is it getting faster? It's not getting faster. This is literally another thing? That's so easy. I'm out of here. <laughs> right? See, uh, thank you for the ghost. This is the exact same situation as last time. That's two days in a row. Uh, that's a really... I mean, I, we could obviously get the motion sensor easy, but we're going for for the big monies here. It could be Mimic, because we only had one example there. This is the time for the wild card to, to go crazy. Nope. <laughs> Just two two days in a row with another 4,000. This time, not five minutes, but one fucking minute for 4,000. Like, this is a good showcase. As long as you know what you're doing, you can solve basically every single round. Unless you have to make a guess, you can, like, make a mistake there. But you're still basically figured it out anyway. Um, and you get big rewards for it. It's, like, so rewarding for uh, if you want to level up relatively fast. I mean, obviously, you need to know what you're doing. Um, is it a Gorio? Are we gonna spend the next 30 minutes with this one mission is the question here because Gorios are gonna make our life very difficult. Uh, we'll see, we'll see. We have still 15 and a half here versus five, the fuck? Five, four all-ins? Where did that come from? We had 500 believers though versus, what the hell? 200 more doubters <laughs> than believers, but they got so many points on the line. All right, let's see it. Uh, Mark Moudsley. Capture photo of the ghost cleanse and EMF. Oh boy. So we're looking for the worst ghost, Agorio, which means it's gonna be like uh, doing lots of ghost events but never roaming. Is it gonna be kitchen? Oh, it's right side again. We've gotten lots of right side spawns. Any bones? No bones. Not here, at least. Let me guess, it's already gonna be locked because you're a piece of crap. Never mind, I appreciate it. I mean, honestly, the right side is the best for, like, staying alive if you don't mind using this cheesy strat here. Uh, I mean, they should just fix it. Like, this has been... There's no excuses at this point. Like, this has been in the game for ever since... Oh, there's a boner. Ever since Sunny Meadows came out. And we have reported it many times and it still hasn't been fixed. Like, what are you, what are we supposed to do in this situation? Just fucking die? <laughs> Which is what I did at the start. I like ran away and went that way because I wanted to avoid it. But you see what happens. You see what happens? Even if you smudge and then run away to a potential shoot be hiding spot, you still just run the risk of getting murdered. What is going on, by the way? Why is it not hunting? So as long as they leave this here, it's like... It's one of those situations where it's kind of hard not to just... Use it for safety because there's no alternative in this hallway. Like most other hallways have some... Hiding spot that's somewhat safe. This one doesn't really. Um... This is strange. It's been a long time. Here. Now it could be a shade that walked into the hallway and is now standing here with me technically, which means it can't hunt. Um, that's almost the, I mean, that's the most likely explanation here. Otherwise, I don't know what the fuck is going on. Definitely demon would be highly surprising here. Still not hunting. What? Wait, that sounded...
Normal speed. How did that not hunt for so long? Wait. Oh, maybe it was already hunting, but... Oh, I think it was already hunting for a little bit, but we just didn't hear because it was so far away. It already... Turn off the breaker again? Fucking kidding me? Uh, is it here? Do we have cleanse? We do have cleanse. That's huge. Okay, we can cleanse. So we cleanse that 5650. Um... So we get... We can bring some items over here. I guess. I don't really know. That's... I don't think it's a miling. We heard it relatively okay. Uh, but that was a really... Even though it already was going on for 30 seconds there, that was still, like, at least two minutes, I think, with no hunts, which is very un common at this level of sanity meaning zero sanity all right so right now it should be able to hunt if it's a normal ghost we just want it to stay in the same it's already hunting now this time okay interesting so it's not a spirit that's so weird okay we good uh this is still the ghost room we really hope so I'm gonna place... This crucifix will not cover the entire room. Maybe. Actually, that totally covers the entire room. Alright, we place that. Stop with that metronome. Shit's gonna piss me off. Okay, and hold on to our smudge sticks. And you give us a sign. That's a sign. More throws as well. We just want to get this... So what is it not? It's not a revenant. I don't think it's a miling. Not a moroi do they... Twins, Hantu, didn't test for yokai. It's cold in there. Can you give us a sign? What if it's actually a Gorio? The believers would lose their mind. I don't think we saw it, so we can't really say phantom. Can you do something? Stay for that. Wait. Oh, you can turn that on. Wait, so there's no main light here. Uh, well then. It used the crucifix and the light is on. So it's not actually a shade or the candle's on. It's not a shade and it's not an Unreal. That is very surprising. So strange how it sometimes doesn't hunt for a really fucking long time at the beginning. Um, okay, so Raichu seems... Oh, no, we didn't. We weren't close to it there. Interesting. I mean, we're, we're going in the right direction for Gorio. Like, it's, it's, it's not obvious right away, which is what you hope. Uh, we should test for Wraith. Can we set up a bit of a polter check here? We could set up some items around around this looping spot here. Whoops, that is my lighter. I would like to keep that. I don't want these big items because they're annoying for the ghosts to throw. They don't throw them very far. This is very janky. I don't know if we can throw the, the alarm clock very far. These books are also relatively heavy, I think, but they make a very distinct noise. We can sound, it sounds like a crucifix rotating every time I get close to this. This thing. It makes like this weird mechanical noise. Ah, whatever, we'll pick this up. Oh, there's another clock. All right, I want you to hunt at this point. Turn it off, you can't. That's so... Look how far you can throw this. <laughs> like, it's so heavy. <laughs> oh. You coming? It's hunting? Come this way. Hello? Hey, you bitch. Hello. Okay, it's getting faster now. We need to reconsider this. That was weird. Like, like I felt like that was simultaneously a poltergeist as an Oni. Uh, let's get this shit out of here because it's too heavy. It's too heavy. 
Um, it kind of messes up our test here. And we didn't smudge it there, so we can immediately retest. No problemo. Yeah, I mean, I guess it didn't make a full tornado, which is what you would be expecting if it's a poltergeist. The problem is that you don't see, like, as soon as it throws an item underneath the bench here, you don't see it anymore, and then you don't know if it's, like, spam throwing the same item over and over again. Um... But if it clears this, that's pretty suspicious. Also, those are um, some annoying clocks right there. I just want another hunt. Come on, buddy. Hi. That was like in the hallway, I think, where it started. All right, buddy. It's throwing, but definitely not enough. Yeah, I mean... Also, I don't think... There's some long blinks in there. Is there? I mean, as I said, it's definitely making a giant fucking mess. But just not enough for Poltergeist. man is it wait this is such a weird like it's like half oni half poltergeist <laughs> like it really blinks a lot but like sometimes it blinks it's definitely not a phantom that's 100 percent um definitely no abaki that's 100 percent definitely no right that's 100 percent um but then a uh, yokai we didn't even really test we could test for yokai do we have two smudges we do have two smudges um, we want just salt. Let's just get the salt. So we can test for Wraith. And then the Paramike as well. I'll leave this here. For testing for Banshee, because that might take a while. Okay, buddy. Uh, I don't know if you're going to do something here, but I hope so. And then we'll put this salt around here. So it's going to be slow when walking here. So we got to keep that in mind. Turn on the metronome, you dickhead. Give me a scream. Normal. Why did? Why is he just walking back and forth? You see that? Hey! He's got heavy boots. This guy. What the fuck? There he goes. Speeding up. Slow, so not a wraith. Slow as well. Nice throw. We get that EMF. Okay. Um. So I'm gonna say no, Oni and no Poulter. Definitely no wraith. Yokai, we could test. I think Yokai is the next test. We need to turn that shit off. It's gonna drive me mad, but it could kill me. Please don't kill me for turning off your metronome, you piece. He's gonna hate me. All right, we're fine. <laughs> go, go, go. We haven't had a single whisper, right? Or did we? So we just sit here, I guess? I don't know if the ghost is just gonna get stuck in that room again because it got stuck in that room until I went all the way out there It's still in there, which is very good for Gorio. I'm gonna click Gorio just to channel our energy into it being a Gorio. That's a normal sound or the environment sound not actually a ghost sound Come on, buddy Big stomps right away. Come out here. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Okay. It's a yokai! You fucker! Come on, man! <laughs> really? Oh. 
Oh, I thought we had it, man. Believers, I thought we had it. I'm sorry. It just walked straight in front of this fucking door. Just one middle finger to the believers. <laughs> That's so rude. Well, I apologize. That was uh, that was a tricky game. That's the yokai cannot hear you. F it cannot hear you or detect your equipment from the same range as normal ghosts. It's like really close. Like, I mean, kind probably the distance of this radiator, like something like that. I don't know, maybe a little further, but like extremely close. Like it has to be. I think it's actually might be this range. Um. Oh. God. You're already hunting? Uh, get me out of here. There you go. It was indeed a yokai. No mimic saving us this time. And that is level 95, which I think is a pretty good setup for the next mega challenge, which will be happening soon. It's been a really long time. Some people that have started watching the channel recently might not even know what the mega challenges are, where we do like a big challenge run with some new challenge on every single map. Um, which we only do that every three prestiges now, which used to be really fast, but now I think it might be a little too slow. So maybe we'll do it every two. But anyway, we're going to be doing that probably next week. Uh, I think that's where we're going to call it for here because we don't want to level up too much because then we're going to get to level 100 before the end of the mega challenge, which is not how it's supposed to go. We're supposed to get it on the very last run. Uh, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. That's a really good, tr uh, really good map. I think it's a fun map. It's not necessarily like, you could like this run that we did here these all these runs were not hyper min maxed for super fast level ups because obviously some runs here were like in the 15 to 20 minute range but there were some really short runs in there and i think that's the perfect way to grind i think the perfect way to level up is play a challenge that is genuinely challenging and then just go like ham on it like don't i think the worst thing you could do when trying to level up somewhat fast is play it like the super cheesers do which is where get a single hunt if you can't immediately figure it out give up and do it again like that is such a boring way to play uh it will i would personally never feel satisfied never feel like i actually earned my level if i did it that way because this way a lot of the time you'll get fast games which will feel very rewarding because those long games in between will make you feel like finally i had a short game even these long games you're actually working for them you're actually doing a hard job and because of the map as well as the difficulty setting you're getting a really high reward even like even for a 20 minute game 4000 is an insane amount of uh rewards there's like one full level even at almost an almost prestige level here uh so yeah let me know what your favorite map is i think this is just a really good map for one variety because every time you go there is different and also since it's medium you get big rewards combine it with a good difficulty and boom you level up really fast hope you enjoyed that if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you just like it dislike it and if you want to join i love the gamers here in chat you can join us over at twitch.tv slash get the link in the description down below thank you so much and i'll see you in the next one bye guys have a good one bye bye